Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to go ahead and fix some cards to see what's going on in this connection. How is your person feeling about you? What would they say to you? Where is this headed? And any other messages we can get from the cards here, I'm going to go ahead and pick from the Tarot Familiars deck to see what the general energy between you and your person is right now. Okay, we got the Knight of Swords. Okay, um, this person has been thinking about you a lot. A Wheel of Fortune. I love this so much. Wow. The Tower. Okay, the Tower has been showing up a lot in readings. Um, even like when I've used different decks. So that's really interesting. I do feel like maybe there's a collective tower moment going on where a lot of people are kind of like, you know, tapped into the same frequency and, you know, in the Kashuk records, in the energy field, or whatever you believe in. And, um, it, you know, if you're watching this, you're watching this for a reason. You found this for a reason. But I am seeing here that, you know, this tower moment that's going on is really necessary, okay? It's necessary for this person to see, um, you know, to realize your worth, to realize how deep this connection really goes, to realize like how much they like you, how much they are into you, okay? Like you've really changed up their life in the best way possible the wheel of fortune is associated with abundance and expansion okay you've had this like very expansive impact on their life or you know they feel like they could uh, they've grown a lot as a person because of you or they have the potential to grow a lot as a person and that you know there's growth in this connection for the both of you they feel like they can really grow with you okay and they want to grow with you they love everything that you do everything that you are everything that you represent the energy that you embody your vibes okay uh you have so much depth intellect intelligence and um you know i'm picking up on that because of the swords energy they love the way that you think the way that you perceive things the way that you talk maybe your voice your language the sweet things that you've said to them okay seriously wow this person is really really into the way that like you know, I'm just channeling all of these beautiful things that they want to say to you, okay? Like, you have beautiful words, something about, again, the way that you think, the way that you talk, the way that you speak, you know, they really, really fell in love with that. But I am seeing that maybe, you know, with this tower moment, uh, for a lot of them, you know, they thought that they had to you know, kind of glow up a little bit to be worthy of you, to be worthy of your time, energy, effort, okay? Because you have so much going on for you, okay? You do so much with your life. You know, you're really um, a high achiever. You're someone that uh, wants the most out of life and you spend a lot of time on personal development, self-development, and that's really paying off. Like energetically, you have never been more magnetic and captivating and like, you know, you've just, you've shed a lot of layers of your past self, okay? The past versions or, you know, just other uh, versions of yourself that, um, you know, like didn't serve you like you know for example like if you went through something in the past you know you're, you're trying to let go of that you're you're uh thinking from like a higher level of consciousness and your person has really really been receiving that energy okay i don't know if you're purposely doing this I, I, you know you're unconsciously or consciously manifesting but i feel like if you are manifesting this person this person has been getting thoughts of committing to you okay this person has been getting thoughts about taking things to the next level having this really go somewhere because they see a lot of potential in this connection okay and the feelings are here like that's the only reason they see a lot of potential it's because that connection that attraction is there okay and that's a big thing because i feel like it takes a lot for this person to feel a certain way about someone and you made them feel that way okay i wouldn't even be surprised if they tell you that they loved you in a dream or something if they tell you that then 1000 percent, like they are um that that's what their 3d self their non-dream self is thinking too okay but i'm seeing something oh, alexa stop oh my gosh wow it's like a wake-up call yeah but i'm seeing something to do with um you know them telling you that they had a dream about you or maybe you'll be dreaming about them i feel like they have been dreaming about you yeah but it's like they're getting some sort of wake-up call to you know um pursue you pursue this connection because the both of you know you like each other okay i also got the seven of pentacles it's so interesting because i have this rider weight deck and um literally all the cards are upside down except this and this literally has to do with manifestations coming to fruition this also has to do with you know wanting to invest in this connection invest in you um wanting you because know, they are emotionally invested for sure okay there's a lot of passion there's a lot of attraction here they're like fixated on you it's almost like they're stubborn like they can't stop thinking about you wheel of fortune we got fixed sign energy taurus leo scorpio aquarius someone could have these placements on moon rising venus we got aries scorpio we got libra aquarius virgo energy i know i repeated some signs yeah but let's go and pick some more cards queen of wands yeah they're extremely passionate about you they like everything that you are like again the energy that you embody you're ambitious you're doing a lot with your life and it's like you know they want to be like you they're very inspired by you they're very motivated by you this is the type of person that would like take your advice like you know if you advise them to do something or make like a certain business decision or maybe you have hobbies and you know you inspired them to 
also you know have hobbies as well yeah we got three of pentacles yeah this person um yeah this is someone who cares a lot about um the material realm they are you know really busy at work a lot i do feel like work takes a lot of their time and energy um i'm seeing like maybe work could be impacting this connection in some way shape or form like maybe you know they're really busy with work or uh, maybe you live in different locations because of work yeah we also got here the lovers but i'm seeing there is some sort of reunion that is going to be happening because the attraction the connection the passion between the both of you is so 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 strong and it's like everlasting it's not just fleeting it's like sometimes you know you can have feelings for someone and it'll be so fleeting it'll be so passing and it'll just be like you'll you're just like okay um cool like i for real thought i was in love with this person and you got over but i feel like for you know in this connection like it's been a while it's like you sustain your feelings for this person like even on those days where you feel like oh i just don't have any feelings i'm over like those feelings come back and you know the message that i'm getting here is that this person feels the same way as well this person also um they're just like wow like this is you know they also lose feelings for people pretty fast like they fall out of love pretty you know fast uh, is what i'm seeing at least with other people but with you it's different Different, okay like they're able to sustain those feelings for you it's like at the end of the day their mind always comes back to you what i'm channeling is that you are the last person they think about before they go to sleep and the first person they think about when they wake up okay yeah we got the two of swords i feel like they are confused about something maybe they are confused about how to approach you okay because we got this clarifying the lovers card so it's like you know they want this reunion they want to connect with you but maybe they're not sure how to go about it yeah but we got the two of wands here okay so they're like currently deciding they're like how do i come forward you know they want to travel to you i feel like if you're at some sort of distance you know they definitely want to make their way to you okay they i'm seeing something new with the world maybe traveling the world traveling to you yeah let's go and pick some more cards yeah we got the king of swords yeah very interesting king of swords queen of wands so i do feel like this person um you know they they can really love someone they could love someone with all their heart but at the same time it's like you know they let their logic kind of like override their feelings the king of swords is someone who you know is capable of feelings is capable of emotional depth but um he thinks with his mind or he even feels with his mind rather than his heart okay like mind over heart is kind of what this person's you know where this person's at because this person has you know had their like heart on their sleeves okay Th this person used to wear their heart on their sleeves and you know they got hurt um in the past and now they're just you know they're, they're being really careful about this but also you know they're being careful about this connection because you do mean a lot to them and they really really don't want to mess this up if you know if they, they feel like if they mess this up then it's over for good and you know they'd be like that they would never forgive themselves okay but let's go ahead and pick some more cards we got the two of cups yeah soulmate connection we got the soulmate and twin flame card so this person does have you know deep feelings for you this person feels the same way for you that you feel for them okay the feelings here are mutual this is not one-sided whatsoever okay i feel like the both of you you know because we got the two of swords two of wands you know the both of you are kind of just you know uh you're in some sort of like I don't even want to say like stalemate situation, but you know you like each other, but like, you know, you're refusing to tell them, they're refusing to tell you, but like, you know, they, they know, like they, they know that you like them. You know that they like you the way that you're interacting and talking. And in a way, it's even like kind of attractive. Like, you know, there's that like mystery and suspense, like, oh, we like each other, but we haven't told each other yet. But it's like, you know, let's just see what the vibes are. And like, you know, when you hang out, you feel all the feels. But this person will eventually tell you that they like you. I do feel like, you know, the fact that this two of cups clarifies the king of swords, king of swords, you know, just swords in general has to do with communication and two of cups has to do with love so it's like they're going to communicate to you about the fact that they do have a lot of these feelings for you and they just grow stronger over time okay so i am seeing some sort of love confession coming in and it's seriously like this person um it's hard for them to talk about their feelings it's hard for them to be vulnerable but i feel like you know they're they've already shown you that they do like you they do match your energy a lot but i feel like at this point like you know they're gonna tell you they're gonna be vocal about it yeah but let's go and pick some love oracle cards to see what other messages we have yeah we got i will be back yeah this person is not going anywhere even if you feel like they are they're coming back okay i want to be like you like i said this person is extremely inspired by you inspired by everything that they're doing in your life and it's like they know that they in order to be with you they have to be at your level so you know they're going to be leveling up which is uh, such a top tier compliment that's like the best thing one can do but yeah do expect this person to be back do expect there to be a lot of positive movement and development in this connection because the feelings are real the love is real the attraction is real and mutual okay so yeah anyways i will go ahead and end the reading right here i really hope this helps you can take what resonates and leave what doesn't you always have for you in your reality i do want to let you know that i offer in-depth tarot readings as well as manifestation coaching and also custom makes subliminal so if you are interested in any of these services check out the description box below where you can sign up for them and yeah i will end the reading right here thank you so much love and light